What's going on, moviegoers? So if you're new to the channel, my name is Christian. Welcome to Zero Productions. You guys, I have a very interesting question and a discussion I would like to have with you guys. And I want you guys as honest thoughts, your theories, and let me know what you think. Now, we all know that the TVA is there to protect the sacred timeline, right? When they first caught Loki, they showed him instances of his past, his present, and it broke Loki. He got to see his mother die that he had yet to experience yet. He got to see Odin die, you know, his relationship with Thor, them finally getting along with each other, not going to battle. And he saw his own death. That scene in Loki was so gut-wrenching to see Tom Hiddleston deliver a performance of the lifetime was such a great experience. Now, in the Deadpool and Wolverine trailer, do you remember that the TVA was there? And that one particular age, that Mobius of that universe was talking to Deadpool. And he was like, this Wolverine let his entire universe down. And he was just laid out on the floor. Looked like he was unco you know, unconscious with his eyes open. What happened to Wolverine in that particular moment? But the big question is, does Wolverine get the same treatment that Loki did? Or even possibly Deadpool? Because remember in that first teaser trailer, we saw Deadpool looking at the monitors. Saw the Avengers, saw Captain America. What if they show Wolverine something that broke him? Like we get such an, you know, a, a, an emotional moment with Hugh Jackman, knowing that he can never be happy, like ever. Them showing the death scene of Jean Grey in X2. I know that shit broke me. I remember watch that, watching that particular scene in theaters. I was broken. I was like, no. And you see Cyclops crying on Wolverine. No. Oh my God, you guys. That shit, it gets me every single time. Or in X3, when Jean dies again by the hands of Wolverine. Or Professor X's death in X3, The Last Stand. Or Logan, Professor X dying yeah. yet again. Or him experiencing seeing his own death in Logan. That he realizes that deep down, there is no happy ending for Logan. There is some kind of failure mechanism that is just in this, it, it's in this, blah, blah, distilled within him that wherever he goes, whatever multiverse or whatever variant, there is always that failure. There's that death. There is that sadness that always will follow him. And when he sees all of that, oh my God, that would be heartbreaking. Look, we don't know what necessarily happened in his particular universe, but the X-Men are dead. They're dead. They're gone. He failed his universe. Nobody knows what that means and what happened. So he's already mentally unstable. He is, he's, he's a retired hero who's just letting the world go to shit. He's done because he failed with whatever kind of mission he, you know, he was on in his particular universe. That would be so interesting. I would be like, holy shit, this, this would be a moment for the character of Wolverine. Or do they show him variants of him being happy? Finally in love with Jean Grey, the love of his life. It's a possibility. Him leading the X-Men. It's a possibility. But I feel like you got to go with the sadness. You got to, like, Wolverine will never be happy. Maybe they show him instances from his past that he didn't know about. From a different multiverse. You know what I mean? Or they show flash, you know, flashback scenes of the, the, the whole Weapon X origin story. Of, you know, the whole programming and putting the antimantium in his body. Parts of his life he had forgot that he experienced that was in a different multiverse. That would be so powerful and so impactful for the character. I am really hoping we see something like that. Like I said in my trailer reaction video, I still want to see a flashback scene of what happened to the X-Men in Logan. I know Professor Rex killed them all or whatever. Like I, I, I wanted to see it because it would add so much more emotional death to the character of Logan. It really would. So, you know, this whole TVA situation has got me really excited in that particular scene. Like, he just laid out on the floor. You know what I mean? I was just like, what happened to him? Why is he just laid out on the floor? We're seeing all the monitors and seeing everything that's happened to different variants of himself and realizing that he can, never can escape this this deep down depression and sadness and brutal life that he will always have no what universe he goes to that is his destiny 
Man, y'all, I can go on for this. This is just so good of a topic, you guys. But push your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think that we will see a glimpse or a moment within Deadpool and Wolverine, the TVA, sitting down with Wolverine and showing him parts of his past, his future, the multiverse, you know, all of that good stuff. I really don't want to know what you guys' thoughts and opinions on this. Post your comments down below. And, of course, thank you guys for taking time out of your day for watching Zero Productions. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.